MILES is an acronym for Minimally Invasive Lumbar Decompression, and it's used to treat patients with central spinal stenosis. Spinal stenosis is a phenomenon where you get narrowing of the canal the spinal cord goes through. For the mild procedure, we're specifically looking at thickening of a tissue called the ligamentum flavum, which is Latin for the yellow ligament. And for lots of reasons, as we get older, that ligament will shorten and thicken. And as it thickens, it causes an encroachment or narrowing at the level around the spinal cord. Well, the mild procedure, its job is to go in and debulk or take out some of the extra tissue inside the ligament and flavum. We don't take out the ligament and flavum. We don't remove the supportive fibers of the ligament and flavum. We don't remove bone. We don't remove uh, ligament other than the parts of the tissue of the ligament and flavum. And we don't remove any disc. This is a procedure done very, very often by myself and my staff. So as a whole, it's a relatively very safe procedure compared to a larger surgery for somebody with mild to moderate stenosis. There have been multiple treatment options for spinal stenosis. They start with physical therapy, which does have a pretty good track record. They go the next to medications, be it things like acetaminophen or Tylenol, Advil, Aleve, and even medicines like hydrocodone or morphine. All those medicines have their own uh, positives and negatives. Uh, other treatment options include epidural steroid injections. Uh, everyone's pretty familiar with those. We inject steroid in the epidural space, the area around the nerves, the low back, and they do have pretty good results, but usually they're self-limiting. They usually last three to six months. Sometimes we've done them for several months at a time, and they no longer have any benefit in pain reduction. Usually the next step then is surgery. And surgery usually requires about a three-day hospital stay. That's one of the biggest downfalls of surgery. But when you have severe stenosis, even moderate severe stenosis, surgery is the absolute correct treatment. The ideal candidate for patient for the mild procedure is someone who has central stenosis. In other words, bulging that ligament and flavum inside the middle of the spinal cord as opposed to off to the sides. It's also someone who has mild to moderate stenosis, meaning that when you look at the MRI on somebody, it's not completely cutting off the spinal cord. People with severe stenosis need to see a surgeon. People who have mild to moderate stenosis, patients who don't personally feel like they're ready for surgery, or the surgeon may not feel they're ready for surgery, or they might not be well enough for surgery are ideal candidates.